Hey, 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 what's up, you guys? Tikamon here, playing Ark Survival Evolved on the Pooping Evolved server. And today, I want to go look for some RGs, because I don't have any 150 perfect tame RGs. This is something you just have to have, you guys. You just need freaking 150 RGs. So, we're going to be looking for those today. I don't think it's going to be hard, but, you know, usually when you actually look for them you're not gonna find them so let's hope it all works out now I've been baking some kibble here give me the kibble there we go Bam. 20 kibble got uh, I don't know 88 89 darts and our ascended long neck rifle so it should be fine should be no problem whatsoever I think we'll be taking insomnia today because insomnia could use some experience so let's just go over to the North Island you guys or whatever you call it. What do you call it here? I guess it is a North Island. Northeast, maybe? The little volcano island. That's the one we're going to. <laughs> and I'll see you there. Hi, and we're back, guys. Okay, so one of these arches over there is a 150. Um, it's a male, but it's in a big fight, so it might just die before we find it. There it is, 150. Oh, crap. It is the one with the white wings, so let's see if we can get him out without killing it. Now that's a challenge. Alright, wait for him to turn. There we go, go into the group. Oh, I'm hitting the RG. It might just follow me. I killed the Carnos. I guess the biggest danger there. Kill the sides, kill the sides. Oh, come on, RG. Come on, oh, and he died. That's annoying about this island, you guys. It's like they're constantly fighting each other here. And if you do spot a 150, you gotta be lucky enough to get it out. 100, 95, 80, 50. No 150, that's for sure. So what I do is I just kill off these groups. That's that's what you do. Just kill off all the RGs and new ones will spawn in and hopefully it's a 150. And then everything will be amazing. But so far... Our only 150 that I did find died. So that's not good. Let's see. Now, obviously, um, for those of you who haven't seen the War Day or the day before War Day, I want to get an Allosaur army for the next War Day. Every War Day, I make a new army, you guys, and I really want to get an Allosaur army that is tamed to perfection or bred. Um, only problem with that is. We need more Diplo kibble. I haven't been getting a lot of Diplo eggs and I need quite a bit for it to actually tame a 150 perfectly. So up until that time, we can't actually start on our army, which is kind of sucky. It kind of sucks. Because I would really love to start on that. Uh, I think if you got Allosaurs tamed to perfection, they're going to be amazing. So yeah, that is just some little bit of patience that we're going to have have to have here but uh, maybe I'll just buy some Diplo kibble from someone I might actually do that got plenty of stuff to trade so that that should be all right oh look alpha 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 come on 150 70 God, it's not even half you gotta die buddy you gotta die yeah don't don't fly around me just die there you go <clears throat> all right so Searching for that 150 RG guys, that's all we can do really. Uh, because I want some 150s, I just want some perfect RGs. The ones we do have right now are like 145s. And it's just, you know, it's just not good enough. <laughs> they have to be better than that. And uh, once I do get a 150 RG, I can obviously breed them a little bit, get some more. And then we'll have, you know, a nice, nice little army. And maybe do something cool with that. Like, you know, right now we have that building that's useless. I'm parking my RGs in there. But I kind of want to do something something else too. Like, you know, to park them in some some cool building or something like that. So I'm going to be looking for some more RGs and then we can breed them and make a cool building for them. I think that's, that's going to be awesome. Anyways, you guys, I'm going to keep looking here. It's probably going to take a while. But when I do find one, I'll be right back with you. Hey, we're back guys. I found a male 150 and this one is not in combat because I've seen more than one. I've seen three. They all died because they were fighting. So we're just gonna go ahead, aggro that. 
Let's go. We're gonna go find a safe spot. Let's go up here. That looks safe enough. Now some of these mountains, they actually do have spawns on them, like over there, those RGs. Uh, you kind of want to find one that doesn't. Okay, so this is this looks pl pretty sl uh, sl uh, sl uh, words. pretty safe. We're just gonna shoot. What was it? Four tranks in his face, and he should go to sleep. Insomnia will take the take the tanking part here. Come on, I would like to shoot it in the face. I can't see its darn thing. There we go. That's a face. Oh, it's coming. Sweet. And that's it. <laughs> oh my god, you gotta love these ascendant rifles, you guys. It's amazing stuff. Alright, well, we've got the kibbles with us. Uh, killed a few alphas here and there. Let's drop that. And I guess we just need a female now. Now we're gonna have to find a 150, and it has to be a particular um, sex, which is even harder. <laughs> but we're gonna do it anyways. Let's see, male... Uh, female. We gotta. We just. We just gotta keep going. I mean, if eventually we'll find one. It's not not that big a deal, but it just takes a very long time and a lot of RGs that need to die for it. Oh well. At least, guys, we got this uh, mill down here, which is great. I don't think anything's gonna come up here and bite it, so uh, we'll be good. I'm just gonna put five, six, seven, eight. I think. I don't know. I can't remember was either like five or eight and um, once we find a female we'll be our bees we did it you guys we downed a female RG now um, I had my sound muted for some reason so <laughs> I was talking to you guys but nothing happened anyways we downed the 150 it's amazing the 150 mil has uh, teamed up perfectly which is great and all we gotta do now is train him a little bit and wait for her to tame up and then I'll meet you guys back at base to make some babies so we can get a perfect uh, RG army going even though we might not even use them but you know it's just nice to have so I'll see you guys in a sec alright you guys we're returning to base here with our two new perfect tame mate boosted RGs it's amazing you guys and we're gonna breed them we're gonna get a little bird and um Hopefully a better one than them, but you never know. Now they're following Insomnia, so that's good. Uh, we're gonna get some gas because I think the incubation chamber is out of gas. I didn't see any lights burning before when I walked past it, so I'm gonna assume there that we don't have any fuel. Let's get, just get two stacks. It's 200 hours. Yeah, that will do. And see if we can tame these things or uh, breed them even. Because it would be really nice to have some good, you know, some good solid RGs going on. Uh, let's see, we've got a male and a female. Now, I'm going to try out a new process of breeding. Um, I'm not really going to try it out on these guys, but I'm going to test the first phase of it. By giving them certain names, uh, writing down their stats and notes. And then for the Allosaurus, I want to have it, you know, all down to perfection. So I do it right the first time. Because I kind of messed up with the wolves and the T-Rexes. Uh, as you can see, we have a billion wolves in there, <laughs> and I have no idea who is a kid, who has which parents, and that kind of stuff. And you really need to know this if you want to breed them and just keep getting better ones. That is, that's just a really important thing. So we're going to try and do that better with the... Oh, what the crap. With the Allosaurs. Because at a certain point, if you keep, you know, like breeding brothers and sisters and stuff like that and they're and the mums and dads with the kids it's just not good it, 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 you need that first in the in the family tree you know all right let's see uh, new gas turn on lights oh there we go we got some light now these wolves I'm gonna I'm gonna pick out a good army like I did on uh, war day and I think the rest of them are just gonna have to uh, you know like be stored somewhere else because we need the room so what I I can't whistle J in here. That's not very, that's very handy. Um, oh, oh no! There we go. We just have to punch our way out. We'll move this guy. See if we can park the RGs in the in the breeding chamber there. I think we can. Yeah, no problem. Bam. Get that guy in there. 
the female in there. I'm really curious if we get a good one at the first the first breed. I think we will. I think we'll 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 end up at 224 or above. Oh, this is just this is not good. All right, enable wonder, enable wonder. I think she has to land. Can you land in here? Oh, they don't fit. That's the problem. Does the breeding work though if you don't fit? Oh god, this is this is horrible. No. Okay, let's see. Right. Enable wonder. Do they start breeding if they're flying? Oh, that's that's kind of great. No, don't fly off. What are you doing? Oh, they're going to land. That's what they're going to No, don't, oh, okay, that's that's messed up. That's me no. <laughs> Female, what are you doing? Where are you going? Come here. She's just like I'm out. I'm out. I don't want I don't want I don't want babies. <laughs> All right. Yeah, we're blocking you. That's right. Now, they might just go wander off everywhere because they don't fit in the chamber. I didn't make a chamber for the bigger dinos. And so far, one of them isn't. Oh, one of them is following me. That's the problem. Hmm. How are we gonna block you guys? I think we'll just park wolves all around you. That will work. Uh, stop following me. I'll park a wolf here so you can walk, and then I'll park another wolf next to that. No! Like, something like this. We'll make a little wall out of wolves. You come back here. We'll park you in the chamber, because you're not, you're not a good listener, are you? There you go. Right, then. There we go. And then you, I think you're good, right? Like, if I park a wolf behind you, you can't go anywhere. <laughs> there you go. Another one to your side. We're just blocking in. Blocking him in. There you go. Where you go? Where are you, where are you gonna go? You're not gonna go anywhere. No, you're not. <laughs> all right. Uh, now I'm stuck. So all we gotta do is just wait for them to get that egg egg going, which is pretty quick. It's, it's a quick process on our server. We'll get our egg. We'll put it in the in the in the hatchery. We'll make it have babies pop out, and then hopefully they will start at something like 2:30. That would be great. That would be a good start. Huh. And then all we need, which is kind of a weird thing, all we need is like a 145 RG. Or 150, obviously. That is not one of these two, because it's going to be their kid. So if I breed that kid, no matter if it's a male or a female, with one of their parents, it's going to mess up. I mean, it's just, it's just not healthy. So, hey, no, stay there. So we're going to have to get another RG for that. Now I do have a 145 perfect team. Um, and that shouldn't make much of a difference. So I think we'll do that. And then we'll get some versification in that family tree. That should work out a lot better. But for the Allosaurs I'm definitely going to have to tame at least 3 or 4 150s. And that is a lot of Diplo eggs. And a lot of searching. Because Allos are, are well I don't want to call them rare. But you don't see them that often. So we're gonna have to, you know, we're gonna have to just play the game and play the game and play more and kill all the aloes that we see that are not perfect. It's just something, it's something that's part of the process. There we go, got babies. Now we'll disable that. Here, hey, I want my egg. Disable. I'm coming, egg. There you go. Oh my God, it's such a mess in here. We're gonna have to clean this place up. Ugh. You go, like, right over there, you know? At least you're not in the way. We'll put our egg here. Bam. And that's just gonna incubate. And once it hatches, we'll be our bees. Hey, we're back, guys! The egg's almost about to hatch. Let's go! Let's do it! Give me a high level! Do it! There you go, little buddy! 213. Okay, not, not perfect team level, but we're gonna imprint on it. And see what it is. Now, what I want to do also with the aloes, uh, the new strategy here is we're going to say this is a mill, 213, parents, and that's where it, where it gets interesting, parents is one with one. Now, that's because the parents right here, uh, uh, there, is mill one. 
So basically his name is one and the female is also one. So if I get a new RG now, a, a wild one that I tamed, I'm going to call it number two. So it's going to be female number two, for example. And then I can say, you know, if they have a baby, I can say the male is one and the female is number two. So we have to, you know, really get that straight that the first number is the male and the second number is the female. And that way you're not going to crossbreed, uh, you know, with parents and, and their, you know, their, chi uh, their children and kind of, st kind of stuff like that. Um, I did not bring any meat. I'm such a terrible person. Hold on. Actually, I don't think I have any meat at all. Insomnia! We got we gotta get over there. Feed this little baby. And then we're gonna look at the stats. I'm just gonna feed it just to make sure, but if the stats aren't good enough or like the best of both, then uh I'm not even you know, I don't even want the RG. I want good RGs. I don't want anything that's you know less good than their, than either of their parents. Because that's just a waste of time. Get back up there. Give that little buddy a, a little taste of this meat. There we go. All right, let's see. We got uh, 2190, 27. I know the stamina is worse. Uh, the melee is, I think, the same as the parents. The health is 2190. 24. Oh, yeah, this, this little baby is not good at all. 2190s, mom's health, mom's stamina, and dad's melee, and just dad, dad's. It just got the dad's melee. The dad has better stamina, better health, and better melee. What? Are you kidding me? Is this like such a bad female that? Yeah, all her stats are lower than the than the than the male. You know the important ones at least. Okay, so that's not good. I'm gonna have to find more females then. So yeah, this little guy. I mean the the, the melee damage is good, but for the rest of it, it's kind of sucky. Um, I'm gonna classify this as not worth to raise because it's only level 213 it has to be 224 or above and it has to have all the good stats or in other words the dad's stats so this guy you know I'm sorry little buddy but you're gonna have to go I'm not gonna feed you anymore I'm very sorry there you go I'll take that food you are you are kinda cute though I kinda feel bad about it we're gonna pretend it never happened he's not here it's all good <laughs> it's it, poor thing. Don't I? I'm not horrible, okay? I just you see the wolves. I did not kill any of the wolves. Well, I killed a few of few of them, but not you know all the bad ones. So now we're just uh, we got way too many wolves. Anyways, you guys, um, that is gonna be it for today. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked the video, please don't hit, uh, forget to hit that thumbs up for me. I would really appreciate it. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, you want to see more of Ark and me playing it, don't forget to subscribe either, guys. But for now, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!